Hi everyone, it's Lynn Como with Close to My Heart and fall happens to be one of my favorite seasons and the colors just pop, are full of warmth, warm tones and they just are so beautiful and I wanted to share with you my new slimline card workshop using this awesome stamp set and thin cuts, A World with Octobers. You can see how realistic these pumpkins and leaves are, the beautiful card that we will duplicate in the card workshop, and I'm going to show you all the different things that we're going to use uh, with this particular product line. Let's look at the papers. As far as the warm tones go for the season, we have some new colors. This is our shortbread cardstock. We'll be using papaya, which is also new, paprika, this nice rich tone of cinnamon, as well as sage and New England ivy for the leaves. So gorgeous for the season, right? Now you're going to love our brand new mocha glitter paper. It's a rich bronzy color and it really helps the cards pop. And then we have this new texture paper pack. So let me walk you through what comes in that. It's six sheets and they're um, two, this one sheet is double-sided. So you have the denim and then the speckled look on one side. I have this like swirl, I'm, I always think of um, tile grout, but then you have the beautiful burlap, so that's that pattern. And who doesn't love brick, right? But the other side is this beautiful shortbread weave, and the colors just work so well for our fall seasonal tones. Now, I will be showing you, this is the stamp of the month for September, and you can earn this for $5 with a $50 purchase, or free if you're a VIP and purchase $50. That's one of the first things I've used on this card, is the thankful for you. And I am doing an ombre effect with three color ink pads. We're using shortbread, paprika, uh, shortbread papaya, and paprika here. But I've also sponged in those beautiful pumpkins, so there's a nice textured look going on that's very soft and different from using the markers which will be done on the next few cards. If we open it up, I've also used the beautiful Slimline Celebration uh, Sentiment stamp set. So I wanted to show you that as well because this is an optional purchase, CC 9214, and it's a double stamp set where you have your vertical uh, sentiments as well as these beautiful horizontal sentiments so you can pick and choose if this is something you'd like to add on. So I'm really enjoying that option as well. And did you notice these sequins? Well, if you're doing this scrapbooking kit with me for pumpkin and spice, you'll also be able to use the same set of sequins for our shaker and these cards. So I wanted to uh, show you, these are loose leaf sequins with some pumpkin in there and some shortbread, some little balls in there and those beautiful silver leaves. And we'll be using them on our cards as well. So you can see how I did that here. The second card, I love the denim and brick together. But then I've also added that mocha glitter paper. And the difference is we're stamping our pumpkins in the black intense ink. And then we have all these beautiful tri-blend markers that you can color them in or use whatever you'd like. You can also use watercolor paint. But they're just stunning together, and we have in the blend family the gold yellow, the dull green, the yellow green, and the burnt orange, and then the tan shades. We just use a little bit of that. There are three markers in each one of these, so you have a light, a dark, and a medium, and we use many of the colors <coughs> on all of the pumpkins that you see here. So you can see the beautiful sequence as well. And I stamped the inside of that card too with the sentiments. This card is just beautiful with the brick, and then we have the glitter and the burlap. Now, if you notice this little scallop, that's part of this window. This is the Slimline Shaker Window Thin Cut, which has a frame, and then the insert, which has the scallop. So we're using that right here. You can see the scallop part, and then I'm using the te texture paper to stamp on. I also use the texture paper to stamp the pumpkins, and I'm going to show you how to use these daubers with all of our inks to get this phenomenal look that you see here. Isn't that gorgeous? So beautiful, the colors of fall. We have lots of new inks, but you only need in the new department, shortbread and papaya. We have paprika, cinnamon, New England ivy, sage, and of course the intense black. Many of my customers already own this, so you're basically adding two new ink pads, which is kind of nice. 
Now I'm also going to show you our shaker cards. Aren't the shakers beautiful? So you can add on, if you'd like, this foam shaker window and acetate for the Slimline collection. And we're using the frames. And then you can use these pop-ups as you want on your scrapbook pages. I will show you how this all comes together. And now you can see those beautiful sequins. And out of the stamp set, I took two of the sayings. So I want to show you, you can use the autumn season or I'm so glad I live in a world of Octobers and use that. Now, in this one, I actually added some orange little beads. Now, some of you may own this, so it's kind of fun to just, you know, put a half a teaspoon into your shaker or the yellow just to shake it up a little bit and change, you know, the look. But aren't they just gorgeous? I love the red tone of this card. You have the slimline thin cut frame as well as the shaker. Then we have our beautiful pumpkins, which are stamped on papaya and uh, paprika cardstock and then you have your mocha glitter as well as the burlap and the brick texture paper bringing all those red and orange tones together which are perfect for the season what a great card to send to somebody even for thanksgiving now this is the card that i duplicated from the catalog so if you can see here this was stamped with a different stamp set so i chose the option of going with the leaf to stamp the outside pattern and then coloring all of our pumpkins in with the markers. But I really, really love the warm tones of the texture weave as my background. It just seemed to, you know, it's just so soft and warm. It just works so well together. So these are the five designs. We would make 10 cards. You have materials to make even more. So I hope you'll join me on Saturday, October 23rd to do pumpkin and spice and these beautiful slimline cards. The fee is $35. You can do it all with me or pick and choose which ones you like. And a shopping list with all of the details are um, available for you to look at.